Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, trapezoid A, B, C, D, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that uh, its uh, side length uh, A, B is uh, 6 uh, units, and the angle uh, D, A, B is uh, 60 degrees. And moreover, this uh, B, D is the diagonal, uh, such that uh, this angle uh, A, D, B is uh, 90 degrees. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, pink uh, trapezoid uh, A, B, C, D. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And in this video, I am going to share with you with two different uh, approaches. So therefore, please watch the video till the very end. Before we proceed any further, let me go over the basic uh, concepts. And here's our very first step. Let's recall the definition of a trapezoid. Sometime we call it uh, trapezium. And now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula. Area equals to height uh, h times a plus b all over 2. And here we can see this side uh, a, b is our base uh, lowercase a. Whereas uh, this uh, side uh, c, d is our base uh, lowercase b. And this side uh, B, C is our height, uh, lowercase h. We need to figure out the value of base uh, B and the height uh, h. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, special uh, 30, 60, 90 triangle. Now let's make an observation. We can see that 30 degrees is our smallest uh, angle, whereas uh, this uh, 90 degrees is our largest uh, angle. So therefore, the side opposite to this uh, smallest angle is going to be our smallest uh, leg, whereas the side opposite to our largest uh, angle is going to be our longest uh, leg. And this uh, longest leg is also called the hypotenuse. And in such kind of 30, 60, 90 special triangle, uh, the longest leg is uh, twice the smallest uh, leg. In other words, uh, if the smallest leg is one unit, uh, then the longest uh, leg is going to be twice of that one is going to be two units. And this third leg is going to be square root of three units. And in general, if the smallest leg is uh, x units, uh, then the longest leg is going to be two times x. Uh, and this third leg is going to be x uh, times uh, square root of uh, three. And now let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, ABD. And now let's recall the triangle uh, sum theorem. According to this theorem, the sum of three interior angles in a triangle is always 180 degrees. And here we can see this is our 60 degree angle. This is our 90 degree angle. So therefore, this angle ABD is going to be 30 degrees. And now we can see that this uh, triangle uh, ABD is uh, our special 30, 60, 90 triangle. And now let's make an observation. We can see 30 degrees is our uh, smallest uh, angle. So therefore, the side opposite to that one is going to be our smallest uh, leg. Whereas uh, 90 degrees is our uh, largest uh, angle. So therefore, the side opposite to that angle is going to be our longest uh, leg. So therefore, in such kind of 30, 60, 90 special uh, triangle, the longest leg is going to be twice the smallest leg. If the smallest leg is uh, x uh, units, uh, then the longest leg is uh, going to be 2 times uh, x. Uh, and this uh, third leg is going to be x times uh, square root of uh, 3. And now let's make an observation. We can see that this uh, side a, b is uh, 2 times x and this is uh, 6 uh, as well. So therefore I can equate uh, 2x uh, equal to 6. Let's divide both sides by 2 to isolate x. So therefore our x value turns out to be 3 units. So therefore uh, this side uh, ad x is going to be replaced by 3. And likewise uh, this uh, side uh, BD is being replaced uh, x by 3 as well. So this is going to be 3 times uh, square root of uh, 3. And here's our next step. Let's focus uh, now on this uh, another right triangle uh, BCD. Let's make an observation. We can see this whole angle is 90 
degrees this angle is 30 degrees so no wonder this angle has got to be 60 degrees and now let's recall the triangle sum theorem once again we can see this angle is 60 degrees this angle is 90 degrees so therefore this angle has got to be 30 degrees and now we can see that this uh, triangle BCD is uh, our uh, 30 60 90 special triangle as well and in this triangle uh, 30 degrees is our smallest angle so therefore uh, side opposite to that angle is going to be our smallest uh, leg whereas uh, 90 degrees is our largest angle so the side opposite to that angle is going to be our longest uh, leg so therefore in such kind of 30 60 90 special triangle uh, the longest leg is going to be twice the smallest uh, leg if the smallest leg is uh, lowercase a units then this longest leg is going to be two times uh, lowercase a and this third leg is going to be a times uh, square root of uh, three and now let's make an observation we can see this uh, side uh, bd is uh, three times square root of three and this side bd is uh, two times uh, a as well so i can equate them i can write down uh, two times a equal to three times uh, square root of uh, three let's divide both sides by two to isolate a so therefore our a value turns out to be three times uh, square root of three divided by 2 this is our a value so therefore uh, on this side uh, bc i replace this uh, a by its value 3 times square root of 3 divided by 2 and this side uh, cd is represented by a times uh, square root of 3 and here i replaced a by its value 3 times square root of 3 divided by 2 times uh, square root of uh, 3 now let's go ahead and multiply everything on this thing we can see square root of 3 times square root of 3 is going to give us uh, simply 3 so 3 times 3 is going to give us 9 divided by 2 so therefore uh, this side uh, cd has been simplified to 9 uh, divided by 2 and here's our final step let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, pink uh, trapezoid a b c d and now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula once again area equals to height h times a plus b all over 2 and here we can see this is our lowercase a lowercase b and this is our height h let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula so therefore we are going to have a half times our height is 3 times the square root of 3 divided by 2 times uh, a value is 6 plus B value is 9 divided by 2 and if we simplify the right hand side it turns out to be 63 times square root of 3 divided by 8 square units so thus here is our area of pink trapezoid and this area is going to be approximately equal to 13.64 square units and now I am going to share with you the second method and now let's make an observation we can see the area of this uh, pink uh, trapezoid uh, is going to be equal to the sum of these uh, two individual uh, triangles uh, triangle ABD area this uh, triangle area plus uh, the triangle BCD area this uh, triangle area so therefore in this method uh, I am going to calculate the area of these uh, two individual uh, triangles and then we are going to add them up and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, triangle uh, ABD and now let's recall the area of triangle formula area equals to a half times the base uh, times height for this triangle our base is 3 and the height is 3 times square root of 3 so therefore the area of this triangle ABD is going to be a half times uh, our base is 3 times uh, the height is uh, 3 times the uh, square root of uh, 3 and if we simplify the right hand side it turns out to be 9 times square root of 3 divided by 2 and now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, other triangle BCD and we are going to use the very same uh, area of a triangle formula and here our base is 9 divided by 2 and our height is 3 times uh, square root of 3 divided by 2 and if we simplify the right hand side it turns out to be 27 times uh, square root of 3 divided by 8 
And now let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, trapezoid ABCD. As we already figured out our uh, triangle ABD area over here and the triangle BCD area over here as well. And here in this uh, next step I have replaced uh, their individual areas over here as well. And if we simplify everything on the right hand side it turns out to be 63 times uh, square root of 3 divided by 8. And thus here is our pink uh, trapezoid area by using uh, both uh, methods. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.